Hello friends, welcome to our channel. Today we are going to see the MCQ related with the geographic information system and remote sensing. So the first question, what is the term used to refer the process of making maps using computer? Option A, GIS, geographic information system. Option B, digital scanning. Option C, digital mapping. Option D, mapping using computer. So the correct answer is option A, GIS, geographic information system. Next question, who is the father of Canada GAS? Option A, David Bigmore. Option B, Megar. Option C, Ray Boley. Option D, Roger Tomlin. So the correct answer is option D, Roger Tomlin. Next question, what is the purpose of resource information system? Option A, weather management. Option B, agriculture management. Option C, oceanography. Option D, population forecasting. So the correct answer is option B, agriculture management. Next question, which step GIS comprise of operations such as reformatting, tabulation, report generation and mapping? Option A, post processing. Option B, pre processing. Option C, analyzing. Option D, capturing. So the correct answer is option A, post processing. So in GIS, the last step is post processing. So after collecting the data, we can reformate, tabulate and report generation is the process. Next question, what is the basic output of GIS or spatial data analysis system? Option A, software. Option B, numbers. Option C, locations. Option D, map. So the correct answer is option D, map. Next question, what function is performed by the data input capture subsystem of GIS? Option A, transformation of data. Option B, acquiring data. Option C, storage of data elements. Option D, retrieval of the data elements. So the correct answer is option B, acquiring data. Next question, what is the other name of 4D GIS? Option A, temporal GIS. Option B, 3 plus 1 GIS. Option C, 4th GIS. Option D, Modern GIS. The correct answer is Option A, Temporal GIS. Next question, what is an entity or a point line which is represented by two values is GIS? Option A, XY GIS. Option B, XZ GIS. Option C, YZ GIS. Option D, 2D GIS. So the correct answer is Option D, 2D GIS. Next question, which is the fundamental method of representing GAS entities? Option A, mapping method. Option B, drawing method. Option C, raster method. Option D, GAS method. So the correct answer is option C, raster method. Next question, which option is not a disadvantage of raster data representation? Option A, decrease of the reliability of the area. Option B, need for large storage capacity. Option C, reduced spatial accuracy. Option D, relatively easy to conceptualize. So the correct answer is option D, relatively easy to conceptualize. Next question, which among the following is not a continuous data? Option A, population. Option B, cliff. Option C, hills. Option D, ridges. So the correct answer is option A, population. Next question, what are the two criteria based on which all the maps are broadly classified? Option A, vertical boundaries and color. Option B, climate and temperature. Option C, scale and contents. Option D, size and theme. The correct answer is option C, scale and contents. Next question, what is the other name of geographic coordinate system? Option A, Rectangular Coordinate System. Option B, Parallel Coordinate System. Option C, Latitude and Longitude System. Option D, Spherical Grid System. The correct answer is Option D, Spherical Grid System. Next question, what is the combination of any two map projections? Option A, Hybrid Projection. Option B, Mixed Projection. Option C, Intersecting Projection. Option D, Perfect Projection. So the correct answer is option A, hybrid projection. Next question, which type of map projection is best suited for use as regional or hemispheric maps but rarely for a complete world map? 
ऑप्शन ए सिलेंड्रिकल मैप प्रोजेक्शन ऑप्शन बी इक्वलेंट मैप प्रोजेक्शन ऑप्शन सी कॉनिकल मैप प्रोजेक्शन ऑप्शन डी अजीमतल मैक्स प्रोजेक्शन द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी कॉनिकल मैप प्रोजेक्शन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन व्हिच टाइप ऑफ प्रोजेक्शन पोर्ट्रेस ए पोर्शन ऑफ द एर्थ सरफेस ऑन द डेवलप्ड सरफेस ऑफ ए सीकन कोन ऑप्शन ए लैम्बर्ट कॉनिकल ऑर्थोमोफिक प्रोजेक्शन ऑप्शन बी अब्लिक मर्केटर ऑप्शन सी मर्केटर ऑप्शन डी ट्रांसफर्स मर्केटर सो द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए लैम्बर्ट कॉनिकल ऑर्थोमोफिक प्रोजेक्शन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन व्हाट टाइप ऑफ वैल्यूज इज यूज्ड इन ग्रिड मैप्स ऑप्शन ए वेरिएंग वैल्यूज ऑप्शन बी सेमी एंगुलर वैल्यूज ऑप्शन सी लीनियर वैल्यूज ऑप्शन डी एंगुलर वैल्यूज सो द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी लीनियर वैल्यूज नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन व्हाट इज द मोस्ट एसेंशियल कंपोनेंट ऑफ जीएस ऑप्शन ए जियोग्राफिकल रिप्रेजेंटेशन ऑप्शन बी इंफॉर्मेशन डेटाबेस ऑप्शन सी सॉफ्टवेयर ऑप्शन डी सैटेलाइट The correct answer is option B information database. Next question which methods are used to derive images that provide spatial information and major data as an input to GIS? Option A optical and digital remote sensing system. Option B analysis by human eye. Option C platform based remote sensing system. Option D ground based remote sensing system. So the correct answer is option A optical and digital remote sensing system. Next question which factor sets limits on both the type and the manner of information on the map? Option A size of the map. Option B scale of the map. Option C accuracy of the map. Option D clarity of the map. So the correct answer is option B scale of the map. Next question how is a tree represented on the map option a point option b line option c area option d volume so the correct answer is option a point next question what is the vertical distance between a given point and the datum plane option a height option b slope option c elevation option d rise so the correct answer is option c elevation Next question what is known as the difference in elevation of an area between tops of hills and bottom of valleys option a attitude of the terrain option b relief of the terrain option c elevation of the terrain option d height of the terrain so the correct answer is option b relief of the terrain Next question what is the contour line option a line connecting points of equal latitude option b line connecting points of equal longitude option c line connecting points of equal pressure option d line connecting points of equal elevation so the correct answer is option d line connecting points of equal elevation Next question which among the following is an example for spatial data set option A numbers option B characters option C symbols option D line so the correct answer is option D line Next question a point of known elevation and position indicated on the map by the letters of benchmark with the altitude given to the nearest foot in termed as option a bottom mark option b bench mark option c bottom margin option d bench margin so the correct answer is option d bench mark next question location represent the position of the point in a option a one dimensional space option b three dimensional space option c two dimensional space option d four dimensional space so the correct answer is option c two dimensional space next question which among the following is not the continuous data option a hills option b ridges option c population option d cliffs so the correct answer is option c population Next question the difference in elevation represented by the adjacent contour lines is termed as option A distance option B contour interval option C gap option D horizontal interval so the correct answer is option B contour interval Next question which kind of the map show several types of spatial data without specific emphasis on the one type over another option A thematic maps option B reference maps 
option c special purpose map option d political maps so the correct answer is option b reference maps next 16 what are the two criteria based on which all the maps are broadly classified option a scale and contents option b size and theme option c political boundaries and color option d climate and temperature the correct answer is option a scale and contents next question which type of map is often referenced like in their use but are made of specific types of users or pertain to specific type of data option a reference map option b thematic map option c special purpose map option d prism map so the correct answer is option c special purpose map next question navigational maps like those in uh, road atlas or nautical aeronautic charts are considered as option a thematic maps option a choro plate maps option c special purpose maps option d point distribution maps so the correct answer is option c special purpose maps next question which type of map focuses on the state and the national boundaries of the place option a political maps option b physical maps option c topographic maps option d economic maps so the correct answer is option a political maps next question which is the type of map in which set squares is used to locate places option a prism map option b matrix map option c square map option d grid map so the correct answer is option d grid map again we will see next video thank you